start the game yet hold on it might help way to go Torver and well bear with me there we go, and that, and that. I think we're pretty much done with the strategy guide business. Now we got the sound going. There we go. Gar. Okay. No. I can't be happy. I believe how long that little switch is when I click on something. We have to rescue Pierce, and then, who knows? But we're loading up air bursts, and yeah. Oh, what a letdown. You're probably like, don't open that, no! Oh, no. Ooh. Here we are, back in the shelter. Thankfully, we don't have much to mess with, right? So. For now. We've got to go rescue Pierce. And then, who knows? Agent Brea, this is Lieutenant Grant speaking. We don't have details yet, but we've received orders to withdraw. I think you should get out as soon as possible. I'm sorry, we've yet to find him. I understand, we won't get in your way. Come back as soon as you've completed your objective. Oh crap. Are we going to get ticking time bomb or or what? You know? Who knows, but we're going to do it.
fierce. Ugh. Aya, this is so cold. Where, where? You're in the shelter. Oh, oh wait. I was running a search on who's been backing this place. They came rushing in. It's okay. Baldwin's behind bars. Good. That's a relief. I was about to become a snowman. You're a busy man. First, you're a mummy. Then you're frosty. <laughs> Better than being one of them. Thanks, Aya. That's twice you've saved me. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. S sorry. I, I, I just... <sighs> and that's everything. Wow, you've been through a lot. It's like you want to finish this yourself. Leave the cleanup to me. You worry about Eve. Okay. I won't say goodbye. See you topside. Ah, oh, so cheesy. I won't say goodbye. I'll see you topside. Okay, well, this isn't goodbye. This is just see you later. It's like, ha uh, 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 why? Now, the last picture that we saw, uh, oh gosh, of Eve, she was at the pod gantry. So, if I had to guess, we need to go to the pod gantry. They're like, the second floor is just teeming with these things. You might want to be, you know, a little careful there, but we don't care right now. You know, the cutscene itself showed that. Oh, neat. Oh, give me just a few seconds. Gotta, gotta do a little bit of housekeeping. Bum, 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 bum. No, that's not the right command. Boom. And. It's kind of odd that these suspended accounts still show up, but. There we go. We've uh, eliminated any threats that may be in there. And now we're going to continue onward on our mission of peace to uh, peacefully blow the crap out of bad guys. Yep. Oh, shoot. What's wrong? Who's there? I'm an FBI agent. I, I can't see. A radiation leak up ahead. So sudden. The heat. It, I took quite a hit. I'm... Done for. You get out while you can. You'll you'll be okay. Those are radiation burns. A rapid mitochondria increased flash heated your cells cells. 
Your site should return soon. You, you sure? You'll be fine, I promise. He won't be fine. Oh. I'd stay, but I don't, I don't have time. Hey, don't worry. The pain's going away, just like you said. I'll be able to walk once I can see. Be careful. Hey, hey not that way. Well, I do believe we might be near the end. Ah, uh, uh, no wonder. You found Pierce? Great. Now for Eve. You can do it. Are you kidding me? Man, they weren't, they weren't lying. That's night. It's 12.05. They're like, no, you, you're so close. And I think, I think we might be. Oh, well. My body is trembling. Danger's near. Danger. Think, then act. Eve must be in there. Why is... Relax. This little one's just like you. She'll be your guide now. Let her go, you freak. Oh, what do we have fear? The Harlequin has arrived at last. Now the stage is set. There's only an audience of one, alas. Kyle. Thanks to you calling in the troops, my samples acquisition's a failure. So much work, so much money, all gone to waste in a night. But so what? My life support's off. I'll be dead for the morning. So, while we're waiting for that, I might as well finish part of the plan. My part of the plan. <laughs> the faith the world is, as they say, in my hands. What's your game, number nine? It's called Unnatural Selection. My little partner here is just what this pupa needs to shed its cocoon. The virus that spread will bring a new dawn for humanity. a &MC conversion on a global scale, now that's evolution. Nobody wants your brand of evolution. Ah, but that is exactly why they must change, you dig? Humans can transform their living environment, true. Most of the poor saps will be happy with cheap, prefab idle happiness. Humans are an evolutionary dead end. They just can't see it. What makes you so sure? Hey. Mm, Madigan, fill in our friend, would you? Kyle? Why are you taking orders from... Our organization is dedicated to guiding the human race. At no other time in the Earth's history has one species dominated like humans do now. It's unhealthy. We're killing ourselves. We're making a new natural order to preserve and save humanity. NMCs create a self-contained food chain. Jane, humans eating humans. I know it sounds bad, maybe even repulsive at first, but it's real, it's forward looking, and it's a heck of a lot better than feel good bozos yelling about risks and peace and equality. They try to spread their influence, use people for their own ends. They're just false philanthropists. 
Or even worse, delusional heretics, sounded fury and all that. Neo mitochondria are the mirror of truth that will reveal them all for what they are. You've seen them, haven't you? They am seas, twisted and hideous. Their true inner ugliness is revealed for all to see. But the people that become animacies were kidnapped. No, you're wrong. They all requested the procedure. They threw away mortal morality and dignity for a shot of eternal youth. Their desires are so-called all-consuming. They're the perfect candidates. The cavalry be here any time. Let's finish it. It's time, Madigan. Finish it now. Yes, sir. Kyle. Using you to get to Eve was more trouble than I thought. Why? Ah. I can't believe it. Well, that's the game. As a child, I felt trapped in this world, nowhere to go. Any time I did things my way, I was criticized, estranged. I learned to do things like everyone else, and things changed. Neo-mitochondria are the same, violent and uncontrollable now. But they'll soon become transparent guests in our world. It's working! Time to put on your mask. Just like me. Uh oh, that thing's gonna be mad. Madkin, you, you traitor. Me, a traitor? <laughs> Please. I was just thinking. Humanity's doing just fine the way it is. You'll regret this. I already do. I should have taken you out days ago. Before you put those these two in danger. Madigan, you fool. I'll take you all out with me. Huh? Four number nine. Aya, are you okay? Kyle. Eve. Thank goodness. I'm sorry. I had to play both sides to figure out what was going on here. I understand. I figured it was a diversion. <laughs> yeah, right. SQ-947C, objective achieved. We've got wounded. Send in medic immediately. Huh. That's funny. Repeating. SQ-947C. Um, Aya? Eve, you, you can speak? Are those stars? What? That looks like... Oh boy, here it comes. I, uh... Quick run! Uh, oh... Oh, it's not a... Death beam, it's just that okay. Not the water to oh dang, 
You see that? Yeah, cut off like part of the water tower just completely. I think they missed. Oh. This does not end well. We know what happened in Terra Grecia. Oh, another baby. Okay. We get to fight another baby. Baby. Okay, well, this is a surprising turn of event. What was that? Death ray of some type. Eve. Kyle. Hi, Ari. You okay? Kyle? Phew. Are you hurt? I'm fine. But he's fallen down below. Wh what? Quick, go save her. That creature he fell down there with her. Roger. You, you go down over there. Hurry! You don't sound so good. Kyle, are you sure you're okay? The blaze singed off my clothes. Hey, come on over for a free show. Whoa! Dream on! In a time of crisis, let's make jokes. Um, it's really not like me to be this crazy about a girl. Really? Did he lose a leg? Oh, ho, ho. he lost a leg. Well, Eve. Pain, my gunshot wound. Okay, I'm gonna say this right now. It looks like Kyle needs to get a leg up. Sorry. Really? Really? Y'all suck. Oh man, Eve, Eve. I don't have it loaded. Death beam? Does it have? It does. 
Hey, you want to see something really cool? Watch this, I can heal. Wait. Oh, that's life drain on it. I was like, I don't want to heal the dang thing. Oh, wow. I beg your pardon, that was mean. Can I inferno it while it's closed? I cannot. That's fine, we'll do that. Yes, that's right. We've taken away some of its health. But it's still moving. Oh, oh, next base, I don't know. Yep. Oh, what a letdown. I was really hoping it'd be like, Avoid the tentacles. Um, yep. Oh. It's weird that we got more health stuff. I'm thinking more fighting, right? Oh, there's a light over there. Let's go get that light. Maintenance bridge. It has a card reader. Are you kidding me? We do all this work. And... We need to use Bowman's key card. She is going to drop, isn't she? Ah, uh, Aya? Oh, even better. It did come back. Eve! Oh, wow. That is a lot higher than I thought it was. I am not going that high. Really? Oh. First things first, we are going to do energy shot. Move. Now. 
That was so cool. Oh wait, what am I doing? I have the power. You're here to tell me that fun. But that thing right there. Oh, confused. I did 900 damage to it. Nice. I got hurt, but I still got to live. Dang, when that thing comes out, like, it's really vulnerable. Oh, we doing that business? Look, we've got little clones. for the next phase? It hugged her. Aya, making her ultimate sacrifice, gave her life bravely, fighting against the ultimate being once again. Oh. Aya. Aya. Kyle? Kyle, is that you? Hi. You're alive. Yeah, more or less. <gasps> Where's Eve? She's fine. She's sleeping next to me. Huh. Kyle, I... There's a lot I have to tell you. Me, me too. But now it's time to rest. But... I... When I first met you, I... Hey! There's someone down over here! A young woman. And a child. We've got two down. They're warm. Hey! 
Hey. You okay? Sure, lucky we found you on peace. Medic! Over here! Thanks to Mist's actions, casualties were kept to a minimum. I see. Good. We'll have to invite that attractive hunter and her friends. And the media. Most of them are broadcasting the cultist nuclear attack story. So the disinformation worked. Well, it was quite a sensational incident. Any reports linking this to what happened in Manhattan? None at this time, sir. Excellent. All our resources are focused on removing evidence. By the time the press gets in, it'll be emptier than Roswell. What about Russia and China? Any concern about the railgun? No need to worry about that. We'll be releasing CG doctored images soon showing a microwave misfire from a solar power collecting satellite. I think our neighbors will appreciate our quest for clean energy. <laughs> hmm. There's just one thing. What's that? That agent we sent. He said he was resigning and hasn't been say seen since. What? He knows too much. He must be found and brought in. I've already given the order, sir. Just think. Our international authority would suffer if this came to light. Not to mention that our allies, we cannot allow that to happen. It's almost a year since then. The FBI moved into action, arresting some of its own, and some missed officers, on charges of collaboration with a private organization. However, all information regarding the organization running the shelter has been classified. Nothing was ever explained, and we were slapped with a gag order. The report released to the public explained the events as an armed cultist uprising and its suppression. Just like that, the case was closed. Neo-mitochondria were filed and forgotten. But we weren't going to just sit around twiddling our thumbs. Following Baldwin's arrest, Rupert took the senior post. He's working with Jody on a secret project. Full public disclosure of MIST and the NMCs. The Japanese biologist Dr. Maeda has proposed the new superhuman theory. By identifying neomitochondrial DNA, he calculated the frequency of latent carriers over a 10 year span. His theory that these carriers would lead to the evolution of the human species is not widely accepted. It was enough to interest Pierce. He's been working with Dr. Ma excuse me, Dr. Meta looking for carriers over the net. They really hit it off, and their project's going well. Pierce thinks that my case, in which the neomitochondria merely strengthened their host instead of taking outright control, is the true path to mutual prosperity. They intend to educate possible carriers before they transform, and thereby reduce the occurrence of NMMCs and the persecution of carriers that would follow. It's clear from his devotion, Pierce has found his life's work. His character has changed, too. No more timid Pierce. Jody is greatly relieved, too. Rupert pulled some strings at the FBI for me and Eve. 
She's not my younger sister. <laughs> well, is she or is she a clone of her and Maya? I don't I don't know. No questions asked. She's been going to junior high for a month now and loves it. Her face reveals nothing of her dark past. She's full of life and quite popular at school. It almost seems that she lost her new mitochondria powers. Mr. Douglas seriously injured in the explosion. He's recovered and now is rebuilding dry field. He sent me a picture of the rifle scope, price tag attached. We've all dealt with what happened in our own way, started new lives. Only, Kyle hasn't been seen, not since that day. Grunt searches for him now and then, but no luck. I haven't even found a trace. If he hadn't shot me, I'd wonder if he'd really exist at all. But he saved Eve, and he saved me, and my browser popped up. Or was it all a dream? Dun, dun, dun. Did I get the wrong ending? I don't know if I got the wrong ending. Shoot. Um. Well, we got a medical rescue, right? So, I hope he didn't get into trouble on account of his helping us. In the meantime, I'll keep searching. After all, he was the one who told me, never give up. Tomorrow I'm taking my first vacation in a long time. Pierce got Eve and me passes to the Nature Museum. Eve craves knowledge. She's so excited about tomorrow. She can't sleep. I'll have to brush up if I'm going to be able to answer her questions. Look, there's a Tyrannosaur, I mean a Triceratops. <gasps> it's... It... Could it be? Is it? It's... More than likely Kyle. I mean, it's supposed to be Kyle, right? Because in the third game, there's a wedding. Fun. Okay. Wasn't that swell? Wasn't that just... Fantastic. What'd y'all think about it? Yep, me too. Um, it was good. It was good. I wouldn't have been able to stay up last night doing this. That that was like forty minutes, right? But um, you know, the only thing that really got my goat made me upset, made me frustrated was the dang combat. Like, the story was pretty cool. The monster design, pretty cool. The combat. And the movement, which ties into the combat, I think. Um, and it's not like they couldn't done it. Uh, so I like how they're like, oh yeah, here's the voices. We got just a few voices. There was not a lot of voices. Just fine. Perfectly fine. 
I thought when they said there was a mole, well, they were talking about ears. But I guess I was wrong. I can admit that I was wrong. No, I can't. Yes, I can. Oh, you could press the start button and accidentally stop the credits from going. <laughs> well, um, that's our balance. That's, that's our balance. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Okay. Fun. Okay, so for me to start over, I'm going to have to change discs, aren't I? Yep. Change to disc one. Let's try this out. Why not? Ooh, replay mode. Collect bonus items each time you clear the game in replay mode. Bounty mode. Find the hidden golem soldiers and strive for a high BP score. Scavenger mode. Shops are bare, and your pickings are slim. Use your wits, not your ammo. Well, we're just going to pick replay mode. I don't care. Replay mode. Don't care. I'm ready for more. Okay, we'll do level one, please. Back to basics. Let's try this. Very nice. Hmm, we got bonus BP for that. Awesome.
I can't believe that Baldwin was the bad guy the entire time. Isn't that crazy? Wouldn't have thought that. I assume that at the very beginning of the game, I believe. I think it's even recorded. I think I said he was the bad guy. So. You know. Pretty cool. Okay. Um. Where's my wings? I want my wings. Ding ding ding. Ding 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 ding. Can't be cool if it's like... You can now put it to level 4. Yeah. Now it does basically the same thing but just costs slightly less yep don't worry we're almost done with this and then we'll move to something else um i just want to see what we can get from jody and then we'll take a brief intermission as i set the next thing up and we'll go from there heads up it's not gonna be the other game yet it's just going to be me messing around in a game. Yes, I think I'll take that. And then ammunition. Purchase as many as possible. Purchase also as many as possible. That's our armor, because I didn't grab any of the other armor. Interesting. Oh, look. Instantly get level 3 of stuff. That's pretty darn handy, huh? And the BP cost isn't that bad, if you think about it. Wow. Well, okay. Well, uh... Why not? Yeah, okay, that... Whatever. Shush. The Gunblade. That's right, buddy. Combat vest. I don't have, like, anything else, but... Buckshot. Ammo. Don't discard it. Whoops. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, did you like Final Fantasy VIII with the gun blades? Because guess what? You can play this game and you can get a gun blade too and it's going to be so hard. It doesn't look as cool as it could be. We're going to try it again. Oh my gosh, we got the gun blade. Now we're as cool as Squall. Remember Squall? Don't know, but I just had a tiny spider on me. Oh no. What if that's the one that I got? Good night. Um, Smurfy. I'm out. Thanks everybody for watching. Next time we'll be playing more Parasite Eve. We'll play Third Birthday. So have a great night, and as always, take care. Bye.